Alright yeah. right, guys, Adrian here. I am Jador TV. <laughs> I'm actually laughing at my intro, which is like killing my vibe right now. But, okay, okay. But we're in I'm yeah. staying serious. We're in Germany, of course. I'm gonna do some shooting today. Where are we? Sega. Tell them where we're at. <laughs> okay, we're in Cologne. Actually, actually central. So we're gonna walk around central, see what we can shoot, see what he likes, see what I like. Because sometimes, you know, he shows me weird places and I'm like, Ugh. Wow. So, but actually we've been out yesterday already. So I'm not sure where we shoot right now. And then we gotta get him some food because dude always hungry, huh? We have to get food first because I haven't eaten breakfast. It's like the crack of dawn, the sun just came up. And yeah, so we need to get some food before we start shooting. And then yeah, we can get to some shooting. Yes, sir. All right, so we're at location one. We are, what, I don't know what station this is, but we're at- It's called Twilight. <laughs> yeah, what, what she just said. <laughs> we're at this, this nice station, look at this. It's quite, it's quite an epic station. So yeah, we're gonna get some, some shots in here and then we're gonna move on. Okay, so with the first location, this actually wasn't actually a first location, we was actually just trying to get to our actual first location, but as I came down into the station, I thought it, was like, it looked like an amazing, fresh, freshly built uh, station, and I thought it was quite big, it was spacious, there's literally no one in the background. So I thought, why not, let's just take a few shots here. And uh, this, these shots are taken with obviously the Young Neo 35. And yeah, by the way, everything everything I'm using will be in the description below. So if you wanna check out um, what lenses I've got, camera, etc., everything will be in the description below. But yeah, the 35 uh, still works great. Even though it was quite dim sort of lighting, it looks bright kind of on video, but even with at F2, it's the, I think the, the EOS RP um, handles low light very well and uh, there was no grain or noise coming into this but the combination worked quite well. Uh, this spot we was, uh, we had, this was actually meant to be the first location in the park. Here I'm using the 85 from uh, Make. Again, the description below, you wanna check it out for yourselves. I think this lens is, is great quality for the price as well. I may do another video on um, is this like the best budget 85 for, for Canon right now? I believe so. It, it's literally the quality was, was was shocked me when I first was using it, and I use it literally more than my 35 now. If anyone knows, I'm a 35 mil shooter, and the fact that I use my 85 more says a lot here because it is a great great lens. But yeah, I was here shooting with 85. Here, just testing out the so you guys can see what I see. The EVF isn't this bright, it's just the camera I'm recording with through the EVF makes it look brighter than it is, but it's not actually that bright. But yeah, the focusing is great. Accurate, as you can just see, was just there, it was great. And the shots come out crystal clear, crisp, bokehlicious, smooth. Yeah, nothing bad to say about this 85. Only thing is, it is quite, quite very noisy. Again, I don't record, well I do record, but I don't record sound with this 85 or the 35. So um, yeah, if noise is a big thing for you or if you're doing weddings, maybe you don't want to be too noisy. I would not suggest to get it if noise is a factor. But for me, as you can see, all my B-roll for my previous videos are with these two lenses. So I have nothing bad to say about any of these lenses. But here we've, I found some good uh, perspective in the background as the pillars sort of went round and yeah just getting some great shots here Jamie she's great great poser great model good expressions on the face um and yeah just great poses around in general I think uh, at a certain point here I switched to the 35 and uh, yeah just getting the low low shot angles you can see there and another thing I was wondering I've used the same edit for the outside shots so if you guys would like this preset if you let me know if you want any of my presets or if i should make some for you guys leave in the comment section below let me know if you guys would like some of my presets and um yeah i'll sort that out for you because i'm revamping my site 
right now so i will be putting up some presets so let me know guys in the comment section below if you definitely want some presets here we've got some rooftop vibes i didn't edit much of these but if you want to check more of these out definitely check my instagram account and jamie's instagram account that's it for this one there'll be more coming from when i was in my trip in germany so definitely comment like and subscribe and enjoy this short little b-roll <laughs> Thank you.